Hi everyone, happy Tuesday. Welcome to my channel Tuesdays with Tish. Um, I know it's been quite a while. Um, unfortunately, I just never feel like I have time, but I did want to share something with you. It's part of a collective haul that I've got from Coach from the retail site. Um, this item just came in and I felt like it kind of deserved its video on its own just because I literally have not seen, um, a video on this item, like, at all. So, I did want to hop on real quick and share with you. Unfortunately, uh, you're catching me on the go and it just really gets dark, um, at like 4 now <laughs> and it's like snowing and raining so I just had to deal with you know the circumstances of what I have so hopefully the lighting is good enough to uh, where you can see the the color of the item and everything like that um, you know I made it a resolution for 2022 uh, I'll be more consistent with uh, my uploads but um, I, like I said, I, I did want to take the opportunity to share this and there wasn't, there wasn't going to be any other time I was <laughs> going to be able to do it. So, uh, not going to be too long today. Um, you'll see, you'll probably see this item again, but, um, it's, it's something that I've literally, since I received it, been staring at. And again, like I, Honestly, I didn't even know this item existed. Um, when I, in retrospect, when I think back, I have seen the style before, but I guess I didn't realize how, what the sizing really was or what it really looked like. And that, I don't know, it, it just, it just surprised me. So without further ado, let me pull it out. Here it is, y'all. Hopefully you can see it. It is the um, Coach Rogue Slim Brief 25. I may be putting the word order incorrectly, but you get the idea. Um, it's a, it's ro or the Rogues have a brief, and um, they have a slim brief, and I think a regular brief. Um, but this is the, one of the slim briefs, but in a 25, so it's small. It's a small bag. And I was actually surprised of how small it actually was when I got it, but, um, it's actually pretty perfect. Um, I wanted something in the, out of the Coach Forever collection with the, like, creatures and stuff. Um, and I wanted something with the elephant print and... Um, the dark teak, this is, this color is dark teak, the, the leather. Um, and I am like so in love with this color dark teak. I really hope that they start making bags out of this color. Um, there's a couple other bags, um, with this actual print that, uh, coach made. Um, there's the regular Rogue 25. Um, there is what they call a a rogue 12 crossbody i believe so it's even smaller than this and it's like a vertical it like kind of goes this way and it's probably about half the bag of this size but um and then they made a card case which i have been on the hunt for and cannot find it for the life of me so if anybody finds it send me a message because I want to buy it <laughs> but anyways um yeah I was pleasantly surprised I literally love this bag I love this print I love the leather I love the color I just love everything I will say it was kind of hard for me to find um it was sold out on the coach website um I had to call around to some stores and was able to pick it up so I don't necessarily like having items shipped um, from the store to me. I'd rather it come from the warehouse and hope and pray that it's factory wrapped. 
um case in point is because when i got this bag i was quite disappointed the hang tag was just mia i don't i was lucky to find it along with the actual you know thing it hangs from was gone um it did not come with a dust bag it came with some scratches on it and because it was hard for me to find and i they're they're not available in the United States anymore to my knowledge um, unless somebody has returned something from Christmas um, yeah I decided to keep it you probably can't see the little scratches um, on the camera it's kind of hard to tell but I can tell and I just just sours it especially when you're super excited about getting something um but it is what it is I, I still love it i'm not returning it i'm keeping it um i mean look at this like it's just it's so cute and it's soft the leather i love it has the brass hardware um i'm the the rogue handles um appear to be like the same size as the rogue 17 handles so if you ever come across a rogue 17 or own a rogue 17 you know how small that bag is so gives you an idea of kind of like what the sizing of these handles are they're super cute um it does have that jacquard or that fabric lining so there's no like leather lining but all like the inside pockets are going to have that that nice thick 1941 lining that comes in the rogues um and other 1941 bags um i don't believe this is actual 1941 bag um there's no stamping of it and i you know they don't make the 1941 dust bags anymore and i didn't even get a dust bag so i don't know um i will say um this is from the men's collection which I feel like this is more of a feminine bag. It's casual, but I feel like it's a feminine bag. The only thing that I feel like makes it a little bit more masculine is the strap. So the strap is thicker, it's longer, and I, I really dig on buying um, men's bags um, from the men's side, which, you know, you can do whatever you want, but um, just because the straps seem to be longer. And I'm tall and plus size, and I need... You know a longer strap and a lot of times I feel like I just always wish the strap was a little bit longer or something when I was trying to wear something crossbody but I do plan on carrying a top handle a lot and um, I will use a crossbody strap I have like a little idea I've already kind of paired it up with another bag that you'll see in another video that this strap will work perfectly with that also features the dark teak color so I'm super excited about it um anywho's let me open this up I'll show you what this strap looks like in the inside of the bag and that'll probably be it um if you do want it I don't know that I have the style number for this one because that was another thing the the price tag was not even in here either so like the you know sales tag they didn't put it in the bag either so all those things irritated me because i like to keep all those things with my bags because not everything i keep forever um and i may you know down the road pass it down or whatever um or need it for authenticity purposes or stuff like that so i really am kind of like that just irritated me that all those things occurred but this is the strap look how thick it is it has one two three four five loopholes I have it on the middle like middle setting the third one and um, it actually works good per it's like a perfect crossbody strap both sides are the dark teak color so there's no contrast um, coloring other than the stitching I really like the dark teak with they paired with the stitching. It's kind of like a lighter purpley color um, that they paired with it, and I just really like it. And 
the brass buckle, the dog leash clips here for them. That's about it, but it's, you know, a thick, comfy strap makes it versatile for other bags and I will be repurposing this strap for another bag and I'm too excited to show you guys at, a, at another video. Um, I'll quickly show you the inside and that'll be it. You'll see this bag again because I love this little thing. So here's the inside. Again, just the fabric lining, but it's that thick 1941 fabric lining. Um, story patch, creed, serial number, all that stuff right there. There is a slip pocket. It's quite big, but that's the only pocket inside. There's no zip pocket or anything like that. Other than that, it's just like a big, you know, hole. Not that big because it's slim, so it's not very wide. See right there. And then on the bottom it says uh, genuine gut loved hand leather. I don't know if it's upside down or not, but I can't see. I'm blind. Um, yeah, I think this will fill your essentials. I just think it's so cute. I love it. I can't wait to carry it. It smells delicious. <laughs> I like to smell the leather. But yeah, um, if you're able to pick it up or find your local coach store and see if they still have it, I highly recommend this bag. Um, I believe the dimensions on this is um, nine and three quarters wide. So, I'm sorry, long. By um, six and three quarters in height and then one and a half inches in width. And then right here is where you hook on your crossbody strap so even though it's small I believe it's a small mighty bag you can fit a full-size wallet in there let me see if I got a wallet so my trusty old Gucci wallet I love the smell of this they have two di different distinctive leather smells the Gucci leather and the coach leather and they both smell good I'm sorry I can't help it anyhows um so yeah, you see it fits perfectly fine in here. And I have like tons of room in here to put other things. So I won't go into all of that right now, but it was more so to kind of share this little treat with you guys. Um, I'm in love with it. That's all I have. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next Tuesday and next year actually. <laughs> Bye.